booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery. Venus clouds. Astrobiologists have suggested that the acidic clouds of Venus could contain life. The atmosphere of Venus 30 miles or 50 kilometers above the planet's surface has the most Earth-like conditions in our entire solar system. With a temperature and pressure similar to Earth, it also contains water vapor and small amounts of oxygen. Scientists have observed that Venus's atmosphere contains the chemical carbonyl sulfide, which on Earth is generally an indicator of biological activity. Even more convincing is the fact that bacteria-shaped particles have been found in Venus's clouds. Life on Titan Scientists at NASA suggest that methane-based life may exist on Saturn's moon, Titan. Titan's thick atmosphere is chemically active and rich in carbon compounds, the ingredients that many scientists believe contributed to the development of life on Earth. Meanwhile, the surface of Titan is thought to be covered by seas of liquid methane. While all life on Earth uses water as a liquid solvent, some scientists suggest that methane could take the place of water in living cells different from those on Earth. Scientists analyzing data from NASA's Cassini probe that visited Titan's atmosphere report that anomalies in the moon's atmosphere near the surface would be consistent with life forms breathing in the planet's atmosphere. However, NASA scientists admit that the anomalies may also be caused by meteorological processes. Bacteria on Europa A NASA astrogeophysicist has suggested that the red tinge of Jupiter's moon Europa could be evidence of frozen bacteria. Underneath its icy crust, Europa contains more liquid water than Earth, making it one of our solar system's most likely environments for hosting life, as it contains all of the key elements thought to be necessary for life. Infrared radiation on Europa is absorbed differently to normal ice, and studies on Earth bacteria have led scientists to suggest that bacteria could live in Europa's water. However, other scientists suggest that the color of Europa and its mysterious absorption of infrared signals is explained by the salts thought to be frozen in its ice surface. Enceladus Scientists at NASA have suggested that Saturn's moon Enceladus may be the most habitable place in our solar system beyond Earth. NASA's probe has revealed that Enceladus has an internally heated saltwater ocean under its frozen south pole. It is the only place beyond Earth that is known to be hydrothermally active with temperatures closest to the Moon's core reaching at least 194 Fahrenheit, or 90 degrees Celsius. It is thought that similar hydrothermal vents on our ocean floors played a role in the emergence of life on Earth billions of years ago. Methane on Mars NASA's Curiosity rover on Mars has reported tentative signs of life, either in the past or present. Curiosity reported surprising spikes in methane gas, raising the possibility of microbial alien life on the red planet. On Earth, most methane is released by microbes. The presence of methane gas may also be geological, but methane delivered in this method should linger in the atmosphere for about 300 years. Curiosity found that the gas had vanished within just a few weeks.